Hello Libra, and welcome. This is going to be your next 48 reading, August 20th through the 22nd. And I, okay, it seems a little sarcastic, but I kind of getting this phrase in my head of, there ain't enough help in the world for what you got. <laughs> Some sort of thing like that, like, being a Libra, I want to say it probably has something to do with love. Um, or some sort of a relationship situation, but I don't know, it's almost like, like you know what the problem is and you're still not doing something about it, or the person you're talking to knows what the problem is and they're still not doing anything about it, and so like no amount of taking things or going to counseling or things like that is going to resolve the problem because you don't want it to be resolved, or they don't want it to be resolved yet. Like, they're, they're procrastinating. Anyways, let's see what the cards have to say. I have no idea if it'll be related to that or not. But let's find out. My Libran friends, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Mars, and or North Node placements. Oh, oh, well that was interesting. The devil popped out, and he was reversed when he popped up, but he popped out and turned himself over several times. We're going to take this in upright. Yeah, that that situation that popped in there. Mm. I have a feeling, Libra, that you might be dealing with a Capricorn or somebody... Hmm. Either you're... you're obsessively thinking about somebody in a lustful sort of way. And that's that sort of like there ain't enough help in the world for what you got because you're enchanted by the thoughts of somebody. Or you are in maybe a karmic type relationship or even possibly a twin flame relationship but more likely a karmic one where you're not quite thinking with your head if that makes sense let's look at what is in the subconscious interesting queen of swords in reverse that's definitely karmic energy in terms of like the um, toxic feminine energy very cutting with her words and um, can actually be, and it's air signs, so it can be Libra card. So either you are dealing with another Libra, or if you're cross-watching, this could be your Libra in here, who is defensive and guarded and attacking, likely, and not very stable in emotions, and is likely creating a whole lack, of, a whole big old mess of things going on. Ooh, and here's the Hot Topic card right on top. This is why. Because you... And maybe they are thinking about somebody else in the past. Or possibly thinking about the past that you guys had going on. And feeling nostalgic about it. But you don't have that right now. I'm, I'm really getting the sense though that this is much more likely uh, thinking about somebody else. Somebody you possibly would like to reconcile with. And maybe you're thinking about that a lot, dear Libran. Let's see what's in the heart of the matter here. Hmm... Yeah. Five of Cups reversed. You're ready to stop feeling like a victim, aren't you? You're ready to stop being around people that feel like victims. People that constantly put themselves in this position. And you're tired of you being in this position. Feeling triggered. And, and not having any fun or emotional fulfillment. Constantly worrying about... Look, if you look in the corner there, there's a little third party guy there walking around... Constantly worried about who, you know, is it uh, hyper vigilant? Like having to feel like you're hyper, have to be hyper vigilant to mm, third party situations that are already unstable. They weren't built on stability. And worrying about who around you might push you off what you're standing on and attempt to just clean things up. You might also, Libra, find yourself in a situation where you are constantly being given extra chores and duties and things of that nature that really shouldn't all be on you, but you're doing it anyways, and this would be a good time to stop doing that, stop being overgiving. 
there's also some sort of situation where you, are, you there's no consensus and spirit is holding your cup away from other cups and their cups away from your cup because you're not meant to stay in that situation it was a temptation and there was lessons to learn but it's not music to your ears and there's a bit of silence going on and yeah this this might be because you are seeing somebody's true colors and you're recognizing that what you built with them is always going to have some pieces missing because it was not there to be built on anyways and you might be re-examining what got you there and thinking about somebody else that you'd like to go see. You might even be doing a little bit of traveling. Hmm. You might also have you might also need to apologize for some sort of situation to do with money or being unstable or it might be um, that you have an earth sign that you need to apologize for. And it's time, time to start new, Libra. Yeah, because when you start, when you give yourself permission to recognize that you've been a fool or, or you allow someone else to recognize that they've been a fool, you can start over again. And that can include starting over with somebody that you previously tried with, but you really have to have a new beginning. Sometimes you have to allow the old contracts to die. You have to allow the old feelings to, to heal and, and go, and then you can have stability and possibly your twin flame come back to you and a happy family situation. Still got a little bit of a wait. But that's fine, because you need to rest anyways. And then you can build and have some fun. But first... The cheaters, the manipulators. I'm getting, I'm getting this card fair amount too in other readings. Um, Spirit is revealing them to people. Revealing what is really in everyone's hearts with all this Leo energy. And... I think you, and possibly, I've got the King of Cups here too, so you and possibly a uh, Cancerian, Scorpion, or Piscean are recognizing that you and or they are in a third party situation that is a nightmare. And you're ready to speak up to somebody who's single. So pretty self-sufficient emotionally, kind to most people, animals too, grows a fairly good garden, might be an earth sign, and you're, yeah, you're wanting, you're wanting to, hmm. You're wanting to be emotionally stable with them, and you see them as your empress. Or they, you know, if they are the king of cups, they see you as their empress. Alright, Libra. If you have any specific questions, the comment section is always open. And I leave my email in the description box if you would like a private reading. Otherwise, thank you for your likes, subscribes, and shares. See you in the next video.